Baku Baku Animal for the Sega Saturn. Baku Baku Animal is a top-down puzzler. In a similar vein to Puyo Puyo, Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo, Panel de Pon, Dr. Mario, and several others. This game was released by Sega in 1995 for the arcades, with this Saturn version arriving in 1996. The game has also been released for the Sega Game Gear, PC, Sega Master System, and for mobile phones. I'm not really sure what Baku Baku means, but if I had to guess, I'd say it's probably the sound that the animal makes when it's munching down on its food. I find in Japanese, there's all kinds of strange words that they use to describe sounds. One of my favorites is gosh gosh, which is supposed to be the sound of you washing your face. When you put the washcloth to your face and scrub it, gosh 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 is the sound that you make. While I can't say that this is the best game in the genre, I can say that it's incredibly fun to play. And if you played your 5,423rd game of Dr. Mario and you're looking for something a little different, this game is definitely worth a look. The way this game works is that within each color of block, there is both a type of animal and a type of food. For example, in the red blocks, there are rabbits and carrots. Whenever a rabbit is next to a carrot, he'll eat the carrot, and he'll continue eating any other carrots in the chain. Gravity is in effect, so after the blocks fall, it's possible to have a chain reaction. Of course, like many of these games, chain reactions result in higher scores. But I find the point is not really to get a high score. The point is to defeat your opponent. And whether you play against a human opponent or the CPU, Doing well results in your opponent getting garbage dumped on their side. In this game, however, the garbage being dumped doesn't come in the form of useless blocks or blocks that are locked for a few turns. Instead, the garbage is potentially quite useful blocks of animals and food. This opens the door to some incredible comebacks from seemingly hopeless situations. This is a great game to play with a friend or, better yet, a significant other. At the risk of being accused of sexism, I find that this style of game has a much greater appeal to the female audience than perhaps a game like Street Fighter 2 or Golden Axe. If you have a girlfriend or wife that isn't so keen on playing video games, have her give a game like this a try and see how she responds. Graphics are rarely the point in these types of games, but the graphics here perform their function adequately and the sound effects have a quirky charm. As for the music, well, what can I say about the music? It suits the game, but it becomes maddeningly repetitive over time. The only real downside to this game is the video introduction, which is absolutely horrible. Thankfully, you can skip it. But why is it with these early CD systems like the Saturn and the PS1, we have all these crappy video intros, very few of them get me excited to actually play the game. Most are just annoying or unintentionally humorous due to their appalling cheesiness. Anyway, that's a topic for another video, I suppose. I'm really surprised that this game hasn't gone on to become more popular than it is. It has more than enough addictive, competitive gameplay to appeal to fans of the genre. If you have a Sega Saturn and you're a fan of top-down puzzlers, I strongly recommend tracking down this one. Baku Baku Animal for the Sega Saturn. I'm the Expanded Gamer in Asia. Thanks for watching.